Hey, it's December 4th. Just got off of work a bit ago. And yep, we're supposed to get about another inch or so of snow tonight. That could be more or less. I have no idea. It's really cold out now. And it's a crappy coming home from work. I just wanted to talk about some things that people usually don't think about. Like, did you know that before <coughs> Easter, Americans eat, consume enough peeps? The, you know, the little marshmallow peeps, they consume enough of those to circle the equator twice. And there has been research on how many bubbles there are in a champagne bottle. Like, according to some research that's been going on on this, it's um, 69 millions of a milliliter, which is 4.2 millions of a cubic inch. And believe it or not, this company has spent think it's something think it's the Heineken company or something like that. I don't know. They spent seven million dollars re trying to research how many you know how many bubbles are in a champagne bottle. They don't give the exact number but they say the average is um uh, actually the average is about two hundred fifty million bubbles in a bottle of champagne. And and everybody doesn't know, you know, a lot of people don't think about this, but there's 3,700 abortions in one day. You know, for me, being an adopted person, I mean, I'm adopted, so... It just kind of makes me cringe at the fact that there's 3,700 girls willing to do that. You know, to put that in perspective for you, 3,700 in one day. It took the Iraq War nearly eight years to accumulate, you know, 4,120 deaths. You know, just better hope than it, hope that Barack Obama supports <laughs> supports abolishing um, abortion if you want if you think he's pro -li if you want him to be pro life. You know, and another thing, you know, just, well, he did support giving out a hundred million dollars in education towards, you know, about this topic to young girls in schools and stuff like that, but really that's already happening, so it's not going to work. Oh, well, whatever, we'll see what happens. And, to and the automaker Toyota is thinking about, you know, have, giving General Motors the right to build the Toyota Prius. So, this was back in May of this year when they were talking to, when Toyota Motor Company um, was talking to General Motors about having it built in one of their plants. You know, so it would probably help out General Motors quite a bit. <laughs> they really need the help right now some kind of bailout, whatever. It's just... I hope they get... I hope they decided to do that. I don't know if they have or not. I'd have to look up another article to see where we'd have to find this out. Just... Yeah. And since 1997, they have already sold over a million Priuses. I mean, well... It was... In, it was... And they didn't bring it to the U.S. until 2000 the Prius, but since Japan started building it, and they had it in, over in their country since 1997, so that's how that is, I guess, that's how that's going. Well, hopefully this is a minute vlog, I don't know if it is or not, but I'm just going to keep talking randomly to make sure it is. Alright, whatever. Talk to you later. Peace out.